Let me see, were you playing with me? Or were you playing with I? Let me think. No, this is I'll be Meadville, 1976. You played with me the following year. We're playing at a Holiday Inn in Meadville, Pennsylvania. Wait a minute, with me or without me? This, I wasn't this, in the band? You weren't in the band. This All was right. before you. This was uh, the summer before you. Okay. This was BM, before Mache. <laughs> yeah. So what happened was, I'm sitting at the, we were, the, the band was um, mingling with, we were on a break, and a guy walked in, and the girl turned around and said, you see that guy right there? And I said, yeah. He said, that's the original Danny Partridge. And Danny Partridge from the Partridge family was a short, Caucasian redhead kid, and this guy was like 6'15", I mean, very tall, blonde hair, looked nothing like the character on TV, but he was supposed to be the original Danny Partridge. Now, Danny Partridge, now keep it in mind, this is Meadville, Pennsylvania, okay? They eat their young. And I went along and said, oh, so you're the original Danny Partridge. He says, yeah. And that's my story for this evening. <laughs> What I remember was we had a gig in Gillette, Wyoming. And at the time, it was like the first time that I'd ever really left Philadelphia. So um, every place was just really exciting you know, to go to. And there was just this blank. It's like, what the heck is in Wyoming? Now, this show followed another place that we played that I thought was kind of wild was uh, Macon, Georgia. And I went there and I was just kind of like really nervous because I'd always heard that, you know, that was like the racist capital of the world, you know. So we went out there, we played there. We, we did get fired because they didn't want Jerome and I to sing. And <laughs> that's, uh, right. that's right. Remember that? You oh, said, you they know, said put the brothers in the back. Yep. Got to go in the back. Uh-huh. And uh, so, um, the back. one thing that you notice in Gillette, Wyoming. What did we notice? All these big white people. And you can carry a weapon if it's not concealed. <laughs> so now you got big white people with guns and knives. And, and help, you... helpless brothers, helpless. Help me, help me, help me, somebody help me. <laughs> so we're, we're there playing, we walk inside the place and you know, all these big, big <laughs> crocodile Dundee, but not <sighs> friendly looking like him, you know, giving us a hard time. And eventually it was the same thing. It's like, uh, you know, we, won't, we don't want the black guys to sing. So, um, so they fired us again. Yeah, we got fired a lot. Yeah, unfortunately. Here's one for you. We're playing in Williamsport. Woo. Williamsport, we're on stage, we're doing our thing there. Two guys walked into the stage, walked into the Holiday Inn while we're playing with clan outfits on. You remember that? We're sitting there and all of a sudden, you know, here we are, just like we are here now. Yeah. They say you know, I'm crazy. Playing. Yep. Uh, boogie nights or uh, love hangover, you know, whatever that kind of a thing. And then finally, two guys walk into the stage in clown outfits and just stood in front of us like this. You don't remember that? Yeah, I do remember that. And do you remember how you looked? <laughs> I was standing right in the back of you so I could see the back of your pants. I guess we don't want to go there. No, we don't. All right, we don't need to go there. Man, I don't know where to go. Excuse me. Oh, go, go, go. Cut. 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 What does it say? I don't know! I don't know. 